black bag. I actually have two of them today. They were supposed to be uh, delivered yesterday and the day before. One of them is little. One of them is not so little in a big brown bag. Big brown box. So I'm starting with the little one. Haven't opened anything yet. Just slit the tape so I could get it out without too much trouble. Lots of packing in there. Packing slip. This one should be just a few things. I thought they were both just a few things. Okay. These, the CC, CC Lamar, um, Barbara Rose pumps. My daughter wanted these. I tried trading for them when they were on the shoe sale, and I never got them. But then when my PLVs, the beautiful blue ones, came, they had a glue spot on them. So I emailed a picture of that spot to CS, and they told me I could choose another pair of shoes up to the same retail value. So these are nowhere near that retail value. But my daughter wanted them, so that's what I got. I'm not trying them on for you because they're going to be a birthday present, so she should get to be the first one to put them on. Ow. This should pop. Yes, finally, the uh, Sejan Robert Ro uh, Railroad. <laughs> Infinity scarf in teal and purple that went out of stock back in October and then got found and then never got re-released no matter how many times I emailed and asked about it. Well, I finally got it. So, it is really pretty. I fell in love with my other railroad scarves. This one still looks a little bit like old man pajamas to me, but I like the colors. This it's got yeah you know, the teal and the purple, and then there's this bright. Um, I'm trying to remember the name of that color, it's not a pretty name. Um, anyway, this bright green. <laughs> that has a name that I can't remember. <laughs> it's a pretty scarf. They're very comfortable. If you can uh, manage to get one, I would recommend it. So this was the box that was supposed to come yesterday. The bigger box was the one from Monday, I guess. Oh, and this, this was on the sale, and I was actually very surprised that I managed to trade for it and get it at fairly close to value because it was the only one and I really thought people were going to go crazy trying to get it. But they didn't. And when I got it, my offer had definitely been the best, even though it wasn't very high. I don't remember what I offered for it. I just remember. Oh, wow. See, it is the glass globe vase. You can see it's like a slanted vase and I just think it's adorable I I don't know I don't know whether I'll use it for a vase or put cotton balls in it or what but I think it's really cute it's really nice and useful so there's that and oh yeah these um pearl earring things that have been on the site for a while. Um, trying. Kenneth J. Lane. And nobody got them and then all of a sudden they started putting them out as stylus picks. So I finally got them after probably two months of wanting them but not being willing to add them to bag. I have these in the other color, the like gray color that went on the sale. And I love them. They're very nice and professional. A little bit, you know, 
they're noticeable and sorry about my hair it's a mess I know <laughs> I, I got all excited by the mail coming and didn't stop to really do much to my hair other than kind of brush it out so <laughs> okay I think that's it for this bag yes that's it for this one you don't need to dig through and find anything else now this big one I didn't think either of these were supposed to be this big because I did some gifting and shipping because all the sales you know, I can't resist opening during a sale I like to open rather than just add to bag <laughs> so I decided this time to try the gift and ship thing because I realized what a pain it is to have two or three open bags like I've done in the past so Lots of paper in this one. Now this is what I've been waiting for. This is the Kelsey Dagger Coney. And I don't know, it's been on the site for a while and I never noticed it. And then someone mentioned it and I looked at it and I was like, oh, that's kind of cute. And the more I looked, the more I wanted. So <laughs> I finally ended up trading it um, with a bunch of my exchanges. Uh, Tara told me what she wanted for it, and I got them from my exchanges and traded. And really, offers on it weren't that great, but it's one of those things that nobody wanted to trade, really. <laughs> so, okay, let's see. Inside, no little pockets or anything. Uh, there's no dust bag with it, which is kind of strange on a purse this expensive. And there are no pockets. It is what it is. Nothing else. So It's a cute little purse. Kind of hard to zip when it's empty. I hope that's just because it's empty, not, not for any other reason. Okay, and it's got a long strap. Let's see. Sits on my hip when I wear it as a crossbody, so I guess that's about what it's supposed to do. There's that. Where to put it? <laughs> okay. Um, some kind of mineralogy. Oh, this must be the lip gloss. This is the Glitz lip gloss. And I think all I've got on my lips right now is chapstick, so. <laughs> Trying to remember. Oh, yeah, see? It's cute. Came in a box. So, let's see. I can't do this well in the uh, computer because everything's backwards. So, if I end up looking like a five-year-old playing with mommy's makeup, that's why. Oh, it's nice. It has a little minty flavor. Um... I like it. It's not like really sticky, but it doesn't have that slick feel that some of the non-sticky ones do. So that's good. Oh yeah, shoes, shoes, shoes. Uh, coconut sandals. Um, yeah, I'm supposed to remember the name of these, aren't I? Nemo. Living in Florida, you better believe I will wear these things all the time. Um, again, I'm not going to try these on right now because it just takes too long. Um, I have a weird message on my computer screen. I've never gotten before. I hope this is working. Okay, let's see. 
I have something heavy on this end, so let me pull that out. The balsam candle, and I can smell it already. Even closed, I can smell this. This is awesome. <laughs> Oh my gosh, my house is going to smell like Christmas all year. It smells fantastic. Oh my gosh, it smells good. <laughs> oh, you want to see it, don't you? Yeah. There you go. Goose Creek. That. Balsam fir. Goose Creek. Yes, there it is. I'm getting kind of crowded here. Let's see what else we have. Scarves, scarves, scarves. Okay. I got the um, Betsy Johnson Never End Roses scarf in black. And I love it. It's like my favorite scarf ever. So I got it in red. <laughs> and they're very, very similar. Um, I'm not sure why I really think I need two of them, but. It is. It's a really lightweight scarf, so I can actually wear it pretty much all year. That kind of looks like I'm being choked. but Okay, so I can wear it all year. And again, this is not something I'm good at doing on the camera. But I really like it. Um, black probably goes better with my hair than the red does, but I like it. So... Definitely, if you can get your hands on it, grab one of these. And some kind of jewelry there. This is the um, Sejon, yeah, Sejon horse scarf in ocean. Um, my daughter, who's about to turn 18, the one I got the shoes for. Well, she's a, a horse freak, and blue is her favorite color, so I had to have that, right? I mean, that's cute. This is another really lightweight scarf, which for me is wonderful. Um, this one is not an infinity. It's... I'm um, trying to show you the width. And let's see. Okay. <laughs> it's a little wider than some of the scarves I've had, but not as wide as Kisses with Snake was. So, oh, yeah. I wouldn't try on her shoes for her birthday, but this is really nice. It drapes really well and it feels nice. Um, it's got a cottony feel. I think it's rayon. But it's got a, a cottony feel, so it's a really nice scarf. And that color is beautiful. You see that color? That, that's a really pretty scarf. Okay, what else do I have? Oh, this jewelry that's over here. I don't remember what jewelry it is. Oh, this must be, um, let's see, I got the double row necklace, two row necklace, Robert Rose in the blue and gold. I think the one I originally traded for was the um, purple one and my husband saw the blue and gold one offered on it and he was like, oh, that's pretty. So this is what I got. And no, he didn't say it like that. I did. Okay. I think I got it on right. It's really pretty. It's got some decent extension to it. Um, take it off so you can... I can focus on it a little bit better. But it's... not very good at this taking jewelry off thing either. It's really pretty. Um, uh, it's got the extension. You can make it a little longer than I was wearing it. I think I put it in about the middle so you can shorten it or lengthen it a little bit. 
Um, and some other jewelry. I don't remember. <laughs> Uh, oh yeah, oh, the the bow necklace, C18 by Robert Rose, the um, the bow double chain necklace or something like that, in silver. I don't generally like bow jewelry at all. I've made a point of not getting any, but I thought this one was really cute. I guess because it doesn't look so frilly. I'm not... I'm not really a frilly person, can you tell? Okay, let's see. Oh, that's nice. I like that. I really like that. Okay, what else do I have? This might be... I hope this is it, because I've <laughs> really kind of run out of room. Oh, this is the um, the Little Goose Creek candle. Um, I have a knife here. It's buried now, so you'll have to uh, wait while I rip open the tape, which, yeah, I don't like that. Oh my gosh, okay, look at this. There's a candle in the box that's wrapped like crazy. I don't know how they do the big ones in the styrofoam, but this is not in styrofoam. Okay, it's the um, American Heritage Jam candle, strawberry jam, and doesn't have any kind of label on it at all. It smells kind of perfumey. Um, I'm not really sure I like it. I'm sorry. Kritz loves it. She says it smells really good. So I'm hoping when I burn it, I like it better, but it just kind of, it's perfumey smelling. Doesn't, I am not smelling the um, strawberry much. So, let me find somewhere in this mess that I've just made. Let me find the invoice and make sure that that's it. I don't see anything else in that box, and that seems like about as much as I shipped, so <laughs> I'm going to assume that's it. Uh, that, so I'll see you soon for another little black bag. In the meantime, have fun trading.